Um, hi, my name's Kaki King, and I'm a guitarist. Um, I'm also a singer-songwriter and sometime drummer, and I uh, I have been playing for about 25 years, which is sad to think about. I should be much better. Um, anyway, I've uh, put out at this point five albums and. Um, gotten to tour the world and see lots of things and meet lots of great musicians myself and work with a lot of great people. Um, I started off playing solo acoustic guitar and I was heavily influenced by people like Alex DeGrazzi, Michael Hedges, Preston Reed. And um, after a while I kind of realized that y there is a bit of a um, creative glass ceiling for myself on that. Uh, in that genre. So I started to play more electric and sing more. Um, I started to write weir longer, weirder songs and eventually started touring with a full band. Um, so right now, mainly, um, I kind of have a, a bit of a double life. I write, you know, kind of rock pop songs and play them on stage really loudly. And then I also do these, these small, subtle solo guitar gigs. Um, so that's, that's kind of me in a nutshell right now. Um, when I, when I write music, I, hmm, it's funny, some, sometimes things just, this, you pick up the guitar and you, it, God, something comes out, or even something, I'll just sit down at a piano, which I don't play with any competence, but, you know, something lovely will just come out that I can apply to guitar. I will say that usually, most of my songs are built around one fundamental concept, and it doesn't even have to become the main concept of the um, of the song. But usually, it's something where you know I've got just one little riff that just sounds really neat, and I need to I work with that and embellish it and put other things around it, and that be sort of you know that's usually how songs kind of start for me. Um, I typically write chordal things first. I, I write the, the, the chord basis for the song um, and melodies, if there are specific melodies, they always come later. And then the last thing that comes is lyrics, if that's indeed uh, something that I put into the song. Um, I don't know why it's always been that way, it just has. Um, I think that's not atypical for songwriters, but a lot of people come up with a melody and then they harmonize their melody and you know, but um, and sometimes it's a very fast process and sometimes it's a very slow one. Um, the first guitar that I played was a four string classical guitar, meaning that it had classical strings on it. <laughs> um, wasn't much of a guitar, but uh, and I wasn't very good at playing guitar, to be frank. Um, but what I was good at it was it was having a musical ear and uh, being able to hear something a few times and then re rem you know just musical memory. Um, so I think that was something early on that that if I didn't recognize it as a you know child this big, um, teachers and other people recognized it in me. And um, yeah, so those are the early days. Um, when you're when you're very young and you don't have a lot of discipline the the problem with guitar at a very very young age i think is that there's a almost a like a lack of instant gratification i mean when you sit down and you you know push a key on the piano you get a sound it's not a hard thing to create when you're trying to you know coordinate making a song you know, a fretting note here and a plucking note here and do both things at the same time on the proper string. It's just, it's just harder as, as a young person with not much of a attention span. And so I think that's probably the biggest hurdle for very young guitar players. Um, I think that's usually why um, people that, pl that play guitar also have played um, they, maybe their parents started them off on piano or drums or something like that. Oh, touring. <sighs> um, touring is great. It's a great lifestyle um, when you 
learn, you have to sort of learn how to get good at it. It's also a bit weird. Um, you tend, someone, I think, uh, someone that played with P.G. Harvey said it's like being underwater. It's, 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 it, everything's a little surreal. Um, when you go from city to city to city, you're, you lose all sense of, you know, what day it is, what time it is in your own country, you know, can I call my mom right now, and things like that. And, um, but it's also very gratifying to be able to, to tour and to play live and, you know, recreate what you've done in the studio on stage, but maybe interpret it in a different way. Um, and uh, so preparing for a tour, I typically, it just, it always depends on what, you know, what's going to happen on stage. I'm, I've done solo tours I, where I've not even practiced <laughs> and I've done tours where we've had, you know, massive band practices and I've done tours where we maybe get in the, to the studio three times and then we're off for seven weeks. Um, so typically I try to make sure that we, there's a definite set of songs that the band is really good at that I know um, and that we're not going to be up on, st and that we have our gear properly set up that we're not going to be having to be worrying about running around fixing amps or getting new drum heads or whatnot so that we're well prepared. Um, but then again, you know, that can change depending on what country you're in. If I'm in, if I'm in the States, I get to carry as many guitars with me as I want. And um, when I go overseas, sometimes it's, you know, I might carry two guitars with me and that's, you know, that's it. And I hire a back line for um, amps and drums. And so uh, that is something you have to kind of be prepared for is to be prepared to be um, to be using different equipment, prepared to have great sound at a club one night, terrible sound at a club the other the next night. If you're playing festivals, you get a sound check of you know a line check of five minutes. So um, yeah, there's it's definitely good to be able to get your get things together very quickly and and efficiently because you don't ever know you might be stuck in traffic for two hours um accidentally and miss your sound check and have to be able to like roll up on stage and get it done